Ah, hello, konnichiwa, odozla, moi moi, hey hey, uh, bom dia, hola, ciao, uh, guten tag. <laughs> it's me, Table, and welcome to uh, an episode of uh, Building Something. Oh, wait, first, beginners, X for mirror mode, comma and full stop will raise and lower your bot, left and right will move it either side of the mirror line for uh, more complicated builds. Now what we're building here is an entry level helicopter. I have no idea what the CPU limit is for when you un unlock helis, but let's have a look. So, recon, let's add that and see what happens. 200, okay. So, the first thing for helis is you want three rotors. Three is the magic number. We're gonna go like this. Uh, there are different schools of thought for uh, alternative uh, survivability things with helis. Um, Dick, dick, dick. So two there, so we can then go out from this point. Uh, we want to keep the ranking as low as possible. So, uh, okay, so there, can I move it back at all? There, there's the magic spot. Right, so you want three rotors. So he's going on that side. Three rotors, bing, bong, bong. Now, you can protect these rotors by doing this with a prism. You can do that so it hits the prism and gets directed down. But I don't like that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not sure. I haven't, it's triforcing area, and I'm not convinced that triforcing is, is, is worth it. <laughs> I know that's so controversial. I know. But, uh, yeah, I'm not convinced. So, let's continue. <laughs> triforcing, man. If ever you want to spend... Friggin', if you want to spend a long time building a bot, Triforce it. You yeah, know, just Triforce that thing. So, it's strange how we're building this. I'm kind of building it uh, in layers. So, let's continue down. Uh, make these into kind of little cute engine things. There we go. This is the, the back of the heli. I'm liking what's going on here. I'm gonna do that. Uh, let's raise it one. Let's raise it two, in fact. Uh, I think that was free. <laughs> Bing. Um, and bread up, bread up. So, we've got the makings of the helicopter coming in. I want to put a prism, not prism, uh, an edge on the edges, the triangular one. I want to start putting that in. And we're going to do this as well. Strange how that bit became uh, grey then. So, like so, continue that to there, and go like this. No, I'm gonna do that actually. I'm gonna go prism, uh, tetra. <laughs> I, just, I just give up on trying to figure out what the right one is. So, like that, and like so. Yeah, there we go. Boop, boop, boop. Interesting, what's going on here? So that's main body, it's coming into there. Again, quite flat on this top section. I can probably get away with doing this. Do you know what, I might just bring this all the way along, actually. Boop. Fine, let's do that. Uh, now, I need to connect these rotors to the main body. Now, you could put a rotor blade in the bottom here as well. And I, I mean, you like you can see that it's like it loves it. However, the robot ranking moves up into eight hundred. Now, if you want more survivability, put that rotor on. Uh, but we're beginning, so it's free rotors. <clears throat> if you want more rotors, you do increase your survivability. That's assured. So that section's kind of there. There's just you know, I'm thinking arrow rods. I'm thinking arrow rods. That will lighten the weight of your design. Can't do that, but I can go for that. And then we can go block prism. And what happens if I go large arrow rods there? Hmm, that's kind of funky. Oh, wrong block. <laughs> Oopsie. Ah, uh, there we go. Now we're all... Wait, why is this saying it's not connected? It is connected, very much so. Do I have to redo this bit? I think I might have to. 
Something about that it doesn't like. Something about it just doesn't like those built separately designs. Okay. There we go. Now we're included. So we've got the body. Uh, this section's very heavy. I mean, I might want to just maybe delete a little bit of that. And maybe, if I can, stick in a couple of arrow rods. Just to lighten the load a little bit. <laughs> Fantastic. Let's do that. Let's do double error rod. Smack bang in there. And then let's uh, go block, block, block. Uh, block. And just drop that down to there. <laughs> okay, fine. What am I building here? A beginning, a beginner helicopter is what I'm building. <laughs> right, so let's put a block there. I feel like I want to do this as well. I just kind of feel like that's something I want to have happen. Now, the underside is a little bit underdeveloped. Underside, underdeveloped, get it, get it? No, that's a terrible joke. Be quiet, table, just build the friggin' helicopter. <laughs> I, found out that, I found out today that someone watches my videos on mute. <laughs> I mean, it made me so sad. Mute. They mute the video. They're like, your sound sucks. You're muted. I was like, oh, okay. I, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I know sometimes it sounds like I'm underwater. Right. Body. That's all good. This is going forward one. Uh, let's do that. Let's just put a little bit on here. Hello? No, I want the prism. There we go. But... Now, we could put another arrow rod there. I'm tempted, but that looks kind of ugly. So what I'm going to do <clears throat> is I'm going to go like that. Just in the interest of having it look a little bit more pretty, we're going to do that. There we go, another arrow rod. Bang. So now we just need to sort out the front and what we want it to look like. Helicopters can sort of carry a lot more weight, so you can have a lot more fun with them as far as designs are concerned. So let's do this. Um, let's do that. And this. You're ugly. <laughs> I'm really struggling. I should have done the nose. Uh, I should have done the nose first. Let's push this out one. And then put on that. Do you know what I'm really tempted to do? I'm tempted to put in... Ah, oh no, this, I was going to put skis on, but the CPU would just skyrocket if I did that. Maybe I need to make a beginner level ski bot. I mean, you don't often see them. There we go. That looks good. Now we look sufficiently heli. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> arrow rods on. I noticed that there's some room for some improvements here. Let's just do that. Okay, good. Uh, brilliant opportunity to use an inner there. <clears throat> Here we go. Let's maybe even do that. Yeah, now now we're getting there. Now it feels like we've got the design going on. So you can in invest in shields for like to, to prevent ground fire from being such a nuisance. But we're not going to do shields because this is entry level. Beginner. We are a beginner heli. So we're just going to use a few more armor, a few more tetras is what we're going to use. Oh, that's too good an opportunity to pass up there. Let's put a block in there and then do that. Good. Good. Okay. That worked out. It was a bit touch and go for a moment there, but I feel like we've possibly got our design. Let's do... Ooh, do that. I am going to do that. Fantastic. Um, corners. Can I, should I have a nose on it? Let's do two stage, two stage cockpit. You see a lot of attack helicopters with that. So let's go like this and have that bit. And then just, uh, oh, I'm sorely tempted to do this. Is that ugly? needs to be refined a little bit admittedly I could do that that could be it that could be the design 
Yes. Let's put in uh, these. No, it's too wide. Let's go with blocks like so. And then uh, those inners. Oh, maybe I don't have an inner to hand. Yep. Like so. Bingo. One heli. Oh, I could even sweep this out further as well if I wanted to. And I could put one in there. I'm doing it. There we go. Right. That's our heli. Oh, you're a mean looking helicopter. Right, we need to arm you. So, uh, we need guns. We can't go just totally. Let's go blasters. Okay, so my advice don't use front mount guns. Uh, use the top mounts if you can afford mount them. Uh, they will help you for attacking ground uh, and air targets. You just get more, more visibility with them. Can I mount two there? Would have been too good. Although it's a bit much to entrust to. Do you know what? I am going to do that. I'm going to go block. I'm going to go block. And then. Uh, there. I'm going to do it. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Like if you're losing rotors, you're in trouble anyway. Uh, two, four, five. And then let's just increase this by one. Put mount it there. There we have it. That's it. Attack helicopter. Bang. Oop. <laughs> Bang! Yeah, the golden rule of three. That's a pretty serious helicopter, to be honest. I hate putting guns on the front like that, though. I just think that really makes them look a bit ugly. So I'm just tempted whether or not I can just score this bit off. And maybe just mount them a little further back. You're just never going to get that on, are you? Let's just mount that like that. Hmm... Three, five. Ah, it's going to be a nose gun. It's going to have to be. Nose gun. There we have it. Helicopter. I've been Table. I hope that's been interesting to you. Uh, not many tips. Just built a pretty helicopter. <laughs> we'll see how it does in a battle. It might need a fourth rotor. You never know. 3,000 robot ranking though. God. I guess helicopters do unlock later. But still, that's quite high. Is that entry level? I don't know. You tell me. I'm a bit out of touch. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, give me your thoughts. Tell me if I've not if I've nailed that or not as far as entry level is concerned. And I'll see you again soon in another video. Take care, stay chum, and also don't forget. <laughs>